Hey, son. Didn't know anyone else was up. No, it's just me. I was just about to grab a cold buttermilk. Want some? <laughs> no, thank you. Um, a glass of water would be nice. Great. Two buttermilks coming right up. So what are you doing uh, looking at photo albums in the dark? Here you go, smart aleck. Drink up. Mmm. What's got you up in the middle of the night? Been thinking? You could say that. About what? Actually, uh... You. <laughs> oh, come on. Admit it. You've always been a closet insomniac. Ever since you were little, you had trouble sleeping at night. Oh, really? <laughs> sure. Always been that way, huh? Uh-huh. That's the real reason why I can't sleep. Yep. I see. I had nothing to do with it then, nor do I now. Not even a possibility? No way. And why is that? I'm not that interesting. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you are. No, I'm not. Not enough to keep you up. It's just... Uh, I can't think of what to say tomorrow. You'll do fine. You've always been good at these things. Much better than I've ever been. No, I doubt that. Just talk from the heart. Start writing. It'll come to you. You know what? It's about time you lost some sleep over me. I spent at least 20 years losing sleep over you. Oh, really? Yeah. When you were a baby, you used to wake up in the middle of the night, and I would go in there thinking I could actually get you to go back to sleep. I'd rub your little back and sing you soft lullabies. And you know what would happen? What's that? I would wake up with the most horrible pain in my ribs, because I fell asleep on the side of the crib. Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this permanent indentation on my side. <laughs> uh, never worked. There you'd be, eyes wide open, just cooing away. <laughs> well, what'd you do then? Well, I would start all over again. <laughs> well, I'm sure I was very appreciative. You were. Next day, you'd sleep all day for your mom. <clears throat> <laughs> Ugh. I'm 63. You know what's significant about that? I don't know. I was asking you. Oh, uh, um, <laughs> okay. Um, you. Lived a full life? I suppose so. Seems a bit cliche. Hmm? You've accomplished a lot. By climbing Everest. Like climbing Everest? Well, maybe I didn't have that big of an adventure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you raised a family. Now that's an adventure. White knuckle at times. <laughs> You've always been honest. You've always been patient with me. I really admire you, Dad. Well, thank you, son. Me too. <laughs> you admire yourself? <laughs> yes. Because of you. I'm really proud of you, son. You're following your dreams. I don't think any parent could ask for any more for their kids. Thanks, Dad. I really, I'm really proud of you, too. 
I love you, little man. I love you too, Dad. Well, I think I'm going to go get some sleep now. Sounds like a plan. Sweet dreams, son. Sweet dreams, Dad. My father was an amazing man.